It'll be another street fight again this week. Yeah, pretty good game Saturday. No picks. I know that's one of the things you're real proud of. What do you want to work on practice this week? Uh, just up that up that completion percentage. There were some balls that could have been completions, uh, location or timing, whatever it was. But to make to make that another priority of, of trying to complete as many balls as I can. And, uh, but yeah, really happy with how how the game turned out in the passing game and you know, no turnovers, which was huge. I was happy when that one got reversed. <laughs> but uh, uh, improved the. the Thanks, I just have one question. Have you had a chance to sit down and talk with uh, Pat Hayden when he was a quarterback? You haven't had a chance not to one on one, that? not really in depth. I mean, obviously we exchanged words and talked a little, uh -huh. a little bit here and there in the locker room or uh -huh. on the plane for a little bit, but not, not too, uh, too in depth. But one of these days, probably in the off season, I'll, I'll get one. Have you film on it from some of the no, ESPN classic? No, I haven't. When you get a to. chance. You'll, you'll enjoy it. Yeah, well, I've seen pictures. I've seen pictures of him and J.K. Oh, yeah. And it's they're pretty classic. The blonde it's, hair yeah. and the whole thing. Oh, it's pretty you get, Have you ever get a chance to see the ESPN Notre Dame, the big 74 game where they made the really? big comeback? You will crack it up. You'll crack up when you watch it because they were really good. I love it. Yeah. Check that yeah. out. I mean, obviously losing is, is something that you hate. But uh, was, was, was Saturday the most fun you've had as a quarterback at USC? I would say yes, and it was, it was just an exhilarating game. And uh, even though we we came out on the, on the losing end, it was one of the one of the funnest games I've been a part of. Just going back and forth and having so many chances to win the game, and uh, disappointed in the loss. But yeah, it was it was definitely a lot of fun. It just seemed like too on offense, everybody. Yeah, they didn't catch everything from you, but it, everybody was making some big, they were making some tough catches and you were making some tough throws. It was just so overall, it just seems like the USC offense is really fun to watch again. Yeah, definitely. And, and guys understood that they had to step up with playmakers. And whether it was a receiver or, or a tight end making a great Even Cameron catch. made a great yeah, catch. He was playing awesome. Woody, Rojo made, made some clutch catches. Uh, we knew we had to step up, and it was about time to be playmaker. So, uh, happy with with how that turned out. Do you feel a part of the, a part of the success this year versus last year? And, and, and obviously, it's your maturity, and you've had a, your, a year under your belt. But do you think the play calling this year is is, is a little bit more unpredictable than it was in the last year? Yeah, I'd, I'd say the play calling definitely helps in our success this year, and, and I think Kip's done a great job in, in getting us in the right the right looks and. Uh, especially in the red zone, I thought we'd been really effective in the red zone, which is huge. And what are the challenges this week with Cal? Cal is probably the best defense that we've faced thus far, and, and they're, uh, I think, one of the top teams in the country. So it's going to be a challenge, but it's, it's going to be easy. It's an easy transition from last week because structurally on defense, they're really similar to Stanford. Mm -hmm. And so a lot of our checks, you know, when they switch from 3-4 under to, to their base odd, from, to their odd defense, it's a lot of our same checks that we did last week. So. Um, knowing, knowing that we just have to be on point with, with knowing what, what front it is or um, what checks need to be made. So, uh, but they're they're a very aggressive defense, especially up front. Uh, their 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 linemen, especially number seven, really gets after it, really aggressive and uh, uh, big, powerful guys. So, uh, yeah. <laughs> All right. With, with hey, your, thanks, Matt. With your